The celebration of the 72nd Foundation Day of the Indian Centre for Cultural Relations, a unit of the Ministry of External Affairs, was held at the Asian Confluence Shillong on the 9th of April 2022. The celebration was organised in collaboration between the Indian Centre for Cultural Relations and the Department of Arts and Culture Government of Meghalaya, and the Asian Confluence. Those present on the occasion included the Commissioner and Secretary Arts and Culture Department, Government of Meghalaya, Frederick Roy Karkongor, who also graced the occasion as Chief Guest, Regional Director ICCR Munish Singh, Regional Advisory Committee members ICCR, Dean of Humanities Northeastern Hill University and Guest of Honor Dr. Streamlet Dakar, and renowned artist and Chairman of Riti Academy Shillong, Rafael Wajri, Special Guests, Director IPR Ajay Bhattacharji, Director Planning NEC Satyan Lama, Commander Shangpyang, Executive Director Asian Confluence Sabyasachi Datta, Officials of Arts and Culture Department, International Students, Invitees and others. A musical presentation from the Pinter Orchestra also formed part of the 72nd Foundation Day of the ICCR Northeast Region. Speaking on the occasion, Regional Director ICC Armuni Singh, while throwing light on the activities of the organization, said that its main intention is to promote Indian culture across the globe. ICCR also aims to promote culture of the Northeast throughout mainland India and ultimately to the rest of the world through soft politics and diplomatic relations with other countries, informed Muni Singh. Culture that we have in our area, 
and how to promote it. That is our main intention sir, and the mandate. Addressing the gathering, Commissioner and Secretary Arts and Culture Department, Government of Meghalaya, Frederick Roy Karkongor informed that the department had recently signed an MOU with the ICCR for the facilitation of a two-way exchange of cultural knowledge between Meghalaya and the rest of the world. Uh, also, um, I would, I'm quite happy to share with you that recently we have signed an MOU with, with the ICCR. We have signed an, uh, we have signed a, an MOU with the, with the ICCR. And this will, um, of course, uh, you know, enable as well as facilitate uh, more groups from, from here to go outside uh, under the support and the ages of the ICCR, and uh, which will also encourage uh, you know, a two-way exchange uh, between Meghalaya and, and the world outside. So uh, I once again uh, would like to uh, you know, extend a very hearty congratulations to the ICCR for this Foundation Day. I must not come in the way of, uh, of my speech and the you know and the wonderful music that that uh, you know that that awaits us. And with these few words, I would like to once again um, uh, you know wish you the the ICCR all the very best as you uh, uh, you know journey forward and as you uh, you know take uh, our culture uh, to other countries and also welcome other cultures into uh, our homes and into our cities and into our state. So uh, thank you once again to all the uh, dignitaries and the well-wishers who are here. Thank you to Sarvasachi for hosting us here and uh, to Mr. Munish Singh for, uh, for his dynamic and uh, proactive presence. He's a live wire in the cultural space. And, we, and as he said at the beginning, we, we are two sides of the same coin. We, we often um, uh, you know, function in the most informal terms, you know, where we cut through the red tape and we ensure that, uh, you know, that the show must go on. Others who also spoke on the occasion included Regional Advisory Committee members of the ICCR, Dr. Streamlet Dakar and Rafael Wajiri. Uh, culture is dying out. And uh, when I say so, I don't mean to discourage the Department of Arts and Culture. I know that uh, the uh, uh, Department of Art and Culture has done a lot, you know, to collect uh, uh, the the different uh, the different uh, um, cultures, uh, not only of our Meghalaya, uh, especially the the untapped culture uh, from the villages. But then at the same time, the, uh, due to the uh, upcoming of the science and technology, most of our people, especially the younger ones, uh, the younger generations, uh, uh, they don't really value you know, uh, the folk culture. So uh, I would like to, to, to suggest here that uh, ICCR in the, its future programs uh, to also uh, try to to uh, you know bring a kind of workshops uh, for the for the young generation uh, so that they will understand more about folk culture because as I've said folk is dying out but we need to conserve it because if we do not do we senior people we people who are uh, you know um, uh, experienced uh, and who have uh, quite a good knowledge of our own tradition no one will do. So we will uh, work as a team, we will work together uh, from the uh, ICCR. I, I know that uh, collaboration has been done always with the <laughs> Department of Art and Culture. So is here, uh, our um, um, uh, staff from uh, Department of Art and Culture also are here. They are very much dynamic. So we will try to, to work together, you know, to showcase more about our uh, culture, uh, not only of Meghalaya, but of the Northeast. And uh, uh, I just want to also mention uh, about Asian Confluence. Asian Confluence has uh, uh, done a lot of programs, uh, especially when the, uh, we talk of uh, Northeast policy, Look East policy. You know, uh, uh, Sabia, uh, Sabia Dutta has uh, organized a, a number of programs, though, though the programs were not very uh, huge in number, but uh, uh, they have significance. 
because uh, you know people can uh, uh, can understand uh, people can uh, can uh, uh, you know voice uh, people can uh, can uh, can talk something about uh, uh, about uh, uh, the culture that uh, they belong to and uh, sharing of culture is uh, uh, one most important thing since uh, you know uh, uh, globally we are uh, talking about uh, uh, about uh, you know uh, how to promote uh, you know our own culture so uh, uh, personally i have seen that there is a kind of a turning point in terms of cultural uh, you know uh, exposition in the state of malaria since the time iccr came here uh, initially I, we noticed that uh, there are international cultural troupe that have been invited and performed here it was a great delight for us to have get the opportunity to experience that. And uh, <coughs> moving forward, he has also promoted, uh, I mean, uh, from uh, ICCR, uh, Master Muni Singh. So it's not just ICCR. I think it's the person in him that has great, you know, uh, potential and the great uh, motivation and enthusiasm to promote our culture here in the uh, Mehalaya and along with the other states of the Northeast. So thank you so much, uh, Munish, for the great job that you are doing for our society and for our region here. And even though Kong Helen Giri have not been able to uh, to present on this, you but uh, we, uh, we always acknowledge her, you know, dynamism and uh, motivation that she has provided time and again. When at that time when she was still, you know, had it been not for her health condition, she would have definitely been in our midst. And I thank her as much.